Well, good morning. It's the school holidays at the moment and uh, that means that the New Forest Reptile Centre is open. And I'm down here today volunteering. This is my first day this year. So I'm looking forward to seeing how the reptiles are getting on and uh, hoping they made it through the hibernation. So uh, let's go and find out. The reptiles all live in their own outdoor environments, which are called pods. Each pod's covered with netting to stop predators eating the reptiles. The netting also stops people putting their hands in to try and touch the reptiles, who spend all their time in their pods, including their hibernation. It's early April now, so the reptiles should be out of hibernation. The adders are always one of the first reptiles to come out of hibernation. They've been seen out on the open forest since early February, due to our mild winter. Our pair of adders are both out today for the visitors to see. This is the female, and she has one of last year's young ones lying on top of her. I don't think there's any maternal instinct involved though. Here's the male adder. He's got a young one coiled up with him too. The young are probably there to get some warmth from the adult snake's bodies. The sand lizards have woken up too. Here's a group of three. I think it's two males and one female. The males haven't got their bright green mating season colouring yet, but they will have in a month or so. The males won't be so friendly towards each other then. Here's a pair of natterjack toads. These are quite rare now, and these two are part of a breeding program, as we can see. Most of the other reptiles in the reptile centre are also active now, although the common toads haven't been seen yet. There's also an activity centre here, which is all sorts of information about the birds and animals that live locally in the new forest. If you're in the area, and you'd like to visit the Reptile Centre, remember that it's open every week during the school holidays, apart from Christmas, when the reptiles are all asleep. I'll give you more updates from the Reptile Centre as the year progresses. Thanks for watching.